think it's been quite a while, hasn't it? Yeah, the laptop that I was actually uh, recording my older Let's Plays on got a cracked monitor, so most of that data I can't really get back right now. Don't know if I ever will. Don't know if those Let's Plays will ever be continued, restarted, whatever. So, uh, why not do the only reasonable thing and start something completely new? The only reasonable thing. Uh, yeah, this is South Park, the Fractured Butthole. The title is a very clever way to describe the inner workings of the game and how you are two fractured sides really fighting as one for the same thing. I'm just kidding with you, it means exactly what you think it does. Anyway. Let's start a new game for the Let's Play. Because we can. Classic South Park. Gotta get... Gotta get the logo in. Oh really, I thought it was made by Nintendo. Jeez, this reminds me of back when you would watch a movie and you couldn't skip it. In early DVDs, they wouldn't allow you to skip it and they just go through all of the things and it's like, I already paid for the DVD, why do I have to sit through advertisements every time I open it? Let's skip this. Oh, you don't want to skip this, dude. This is sweet. Okay, Cartman, I'll take what your word for it. of this city? There used to be laws, justice. Not anymore. Crime is out of control. Cats are missing, and townspeople are being victimized. Oh, hey! Who pooped on my porch? What's going on with you? Whoa! Whoa! We were supposed to protect those who couldn't protect themselves. Get, get off my car, you little pecker! Now superheroes are torn apart by political differences. We are two sides at war. But war isn't going to save our city. Time travel is my only hope now. Myths tell of ancient times. When a new king united a kingdom torn apart by a powerful stick. Hi, hon. Shut up, man. There's no time to waste. I have to go back, change the present if I can, and find this cat. And in doing so, perhaps I can change what has happened to all of us. Title screen is unironically the most graphically impressive thing in this game. All right, let's let's make the same character I always make. I want to go for something, and nah, fuck it. I'm, I'm I'll just go for dark purple. It's very important. Don't want the fashion police on you. I think we're done. Ah, oh, one of the most infamous things of South Park. <laughs> and Cartman will soon be on to tell you. Don't worry, this doesn't affect combat. Just every other aspect of your whole life. Yeah, this isn't the combat difficulty slider. As far as I know, it affects how much money you get. And I've heard it affects XP, but I've really never heard anything concrete on that. But I'm a pasty bitch IRL, so I'm going to be a pasty bitch in-game. That's all I know, being a pasty bitch. The Moorish are attacking! There's Moorish everywhere! Don't let them get to our base! So you're saying there's more Moorish? Fellas, they got the base! 
You gotta stop him! Fight the Morik! Their armor is too strong! They're wearing bicycle helmets! Where is the king? Taking a shed. Best mini game in all the land. Shitting. Yeah, I'm not going to go around taking a shit in every single to toilet. That is not something I'm going to find interesting. We should be happy that he's made Sorry, friends in this town so quickly. We came here to hide. More friends just means more trouble. You're being paranoid. You need to lay off that stuff. It's changing you. Oh, lay off. It's the one thing that helps me relax from your stupid shit. Oh, hey, whippersnapper. Didn't see you there. Your friends are downstairs, kiddo. Get out there and play. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, we have a very interesting family. What you doing there, buddy? Ooh, the pot brownie. Classic. A staple. You enjoy that. We have all the time in the world. We also have all of this stuff. <laughs> From various... DLC. Yeah, quite a lot of stuff. It just keeps coming, doesn't it? There's no sign of it stopping. Okay. It stopped. Now we're ready to look our part. Look the best. I hear crying. Let's investigate. Mommy, stop crying, sweetheart. I just have something stuck in my eye. Poor girl. And I'm not talking about the mom. My lord, the filthy Morris are attempting to overtake Koopa Kid. You gotta get that. My lord, come on, dude! What, you just moved to town and you get to be king? Well, I think you're a little pussy. <laughs> yeah, everyone else has swords and shields. See how you like this, king. king only needs one thing. To punch you in the face. Okay, really See, this Kyle has the right idea. Right now, this is basically just a tutorial to show off the very basics of the combat. And I do mean basics. Remember, it's fine to commit atrocities as long as you're the good guy. You can commit as many atrocities as you want. I think this will kill the guy in the back, I'm not sure. Yep. Just really, really basic combat right now. Stand aside or die. We're going through that door. You can't. Oh yeah, why not? Because everything in front of here is lava. Oh, dude, no way. All that is lava? Yep, everything from here to here is lava. You can't cross it. Shit! 
Come on, let's get inside. We can't, they're seeing everything in front of the door is lava. Oh, that's not fair. What do we do, the king? What do you do now? You die! Release the dragon! Oh no, the dragon. However will we survive? A dragon? <clears throat> We're just going to beat you into the dragon. And now here is a... Oh, not yet. Here's another very basic introduction to combat. All of those squares... Uh, All of those squares will just hit anything standing on it at the end of the turn, so... You don't want that to be you. You want that to be that asshole. Ah, damn it. Okay, if you get a fire breath attack, you can't stop the kid. Car. Car. This car is always scripted. I have never not seen it come in this fight. Street, damn kids. Clear. Yeah, occasionally that'll happen is just a car will come. It it really doesn't happen often, so it's not like it frequently breaks up gameplay. And yeah, this is just so ridiculously overpowered, but this is the only time you get to use it. King Douchebag! The Dragon Slayer. Oh my god, he defeated the dragon! No freaking way! That kid's amazing! Thank you. Yeah, here's where everyone sucks your dick. Wow! Did you see that? The king's amazing! I wouldn't be surprised if you were black if they the were a head. lot hey, less dick sucking right now. Did you see how he moved that letter and used it to clan up? He truly is the most powerful king in all the realms. Oh, uh, he's amazing. Fun fact, Be of the two playthroughs I've done of this before that, I died both times on that cutscene. Lies! You shall feel the wrath of Lamorish! The first time I wasn't expecting it, the second time I was expecting it to be a Y prompt. They say he can slay a dragon with one blow. That's right! And if you don't... Wait, wait, whoa, where is the wizard? Uh, I thought he was with you guys. Now we got a distress signal to come help him here. The wizard is gone! My name is the King. I'm from the future. Dude, we said we're not playing that anymore. Yeah, we're all split up. What's the point? This is the point! In my time, there is a massive crime wave and missing cats. I knew my only hope was to assemble the team. Hey, you can't switch games like this. Where's the stick of truth? Shut up, Kevin. This isn't about some dumb stick. There's a cat in trouble, and it's the key to finding the crime syndicate new to our town. In the future. Crime syndicate? That, that sounds too heavy for Coon and Fred. Well, what do you want, Clyde? You want the fucking Freedom Pals to find the missing cat? Get the $100 reward and make their superhero franchise more popular? Fuck the Freedom Pals, dude. That's right. Oopsikins! There's a loud ringing coming from your basement playroom! The Coon Alert! Come on, Coon friends! Go get your stuff and report back to the Coon Lair! In the future, Coon and friends assemble! Sorry guys, you can't play with us. We're playing superheroes now and you guys are dorks. I'm not a dork. I'm not a dork, what are you... Oh, they're sad. They don't want to be called dorks either. Oh, hello. The boys are down in their little basement playroom. I see. Yeah, there's a passcode you can't get into, so... Where are we going to find the passcode? Well, there's only one. One place we could go. And... This is really going to put some light on exactly how messed up Cartman actually is. Why is he drawing any of this? Why was that something he felt the need to do? Nah, just a bunch of references to other South Park. Officer, somebody yeah, I feel like that's something in this game that you could remove it, and I, uh... Hard, but, but my son told me 
I would <sighs> to death definitely wouldn't be complaining uh -huh. if it was removed. I'll say that much. The waitresses know anything. That's not enough, Mosquito. We have to act fast before the Freedom Pals can. A hundred dollar reward. Do you know what that could mean to our superhero franchise? That cat looks pretty old. Maybe it just died in the gutter somewhere. Human Kite, do I have to remind you that as of right now, Freedom Pals have a hundred followers on Instagram? We have six. The five of us and Billy Turner, who's a ginger. This is the key to finally beating those fuckers. But where do we start looking? That cat could be anyway. We need to split up. Mosquito, take to the air and check out all the city parks. You got it. Mosquito away. Human Kite, see if the cat is stuck up a tree somewhere. You've got the storm drain, Super Craig. Super Craig. Fast Pass, I need you to use your superhuman speed to get to the mayor's office and tell her we're on the case. Don't worry, Coon. You can count on Fast Pass to get there fast. Hello there, Jimmy. Excuse me. Super Craig. Super Craig, this is Coon. Do you copy? Super Craig, the fuck are you? I repeat, the fuck are you, Super Craig? Oh, wait. Now the security system isn't working? Dude, what the fuck? Ordinary citizens aren't allowed in the coon lair. We're playing I'm the king. now, and you aren't a superhero, new kid, so fuck off, okay? I'm not going to. What are you going to do about it? Uh, all right, look, you can watch us play superheroes as long as you don't get in the way. Make yourself useful. Go grab me the Stephanie device. It's over there. Oh, okay. Here you go, best buddy. Well, that took long enough. Shut the up. Device active. <laughs> you really want to be a superhero, huh? Play with the big boys? Not really, well, I just don't have anything better to maybe do. Maybe you can be useful. Have a seat at the table, douchebag. Let's see, mosquitoes, ABLs. Jesus Christ, are these even in a human language? All right, in order to play superheroes, you have to have a superhero persona. Then you can fill out your character sheet on Coonstagram. Whoa, whoa, you whoa, did you say persona? Oh boy, you're not even on Coonstagram, huh? Well, I guess I can create one for you. But, well, well, let's go back to when you said I needed so persona, Mr. Mr. Raccoon your Boy. Sheet is your class. You know, what kind of superhero are you? Final yeah. girl. These two are from the DLCs. Um, usually I go with, like, Nether Blaster, Blaster, Netherborn, that kind of stuff. Final girl. I'm actually Brutalist. gonna go with Brutalist just because I haven't went with those like physical brawn classes, and it'll be a new experience for me. A Brutalist, like the Thing, or a really pissed off Batman. And I also won't really uh. Okay, douchebag. But now we need to find out what terrible thing in your past drives you. You see, douche, all superheroes have a compelling backstory. It's from that backstory that their powers gain meaning. Let's take you back to when you were just a child. Oh no. My therapist. You lay awake that night. Like so many other nights, you couldn't sleep because you knew you weren't like the other kids. You walked to the mirror. You looked in the mirror and you felt alone. And that's when it happened. A loud noise. You swore you could hear your mother calling for help. You left your room. That does not sound like a call for help. I don't want to leave my room. You left. Your room! No, I didn't. I'm not investigating that. Seriously, dude, just walk through the door already? Fine. Out in the hallway, you saw two intruders in front of your parents' door! You had to stop them from hurting your parents. You knew you had the power to stop them, so for the first time, you called upon your super strength powers! As a super strong, brutalist hero, you cracked your knuckles and prepared to brawl. You met the intruders' mocking words with a swift, brutal bash! Knocked backwards, the Megafist Uncheru. Damn, what are you, some kind of superhero? Weakly retaliated. Just a little bit. You had him on the ropes, but then two more ne'er-do-wells entered the fray from behind. So you turned around to face your new foes. Oh no. Your wrecking ball like inertia sent oh, one I... tumbling into the other. Oh, I'll take care of the kid, fellow ne'er-do-wells. The first intruder ran into the fray, boxing you in, right where they wanted you. We've got you right where we want you, kid. Huh. 
<laughs> what are you gonna yeah, do this now, is basically superhero? just a scripted fight. You who had them, as you executed a powerful blast from your bowels. <sighs> the whole point is to teach you about, like, the Fucking abilities disgusting. you have. Oh, I can't take it anymore! <laughs> One of the thugs was so grossed out that it literally finished him off! Nice! As his companions fled, the biggest, ugliest intruder moved in closer. Oh no. He, he looks mean. In your body. But with each hit, he only unlocked what lies in me. Something totally brutal. <laughs> yeah, that is sweet, man. Eh? The head bash special. And so you beat them. All seemed to be okay. But then you finally reached your parents' door. Oh no. And what you saw when you opened that door changed your life forever. Oh no, what did I see? Crime. You were what too happened? late. Because when you opened that door you saw you saw your dad fuck your man. No oh my god. Wow, that's a pretty heavy backstory. You fight crime because you never forgot the night you weren't in time. And you saw your own father, the man you trusted, fuck your man. It's like a ripple in time you can't ever change, isn't it? Alright. Now that you're a superhero, yeah, I have a mission up. for you. I need you to go out into town and try to get as many followers as you can on Instagram. It's the only way our Who franchise fucks a man's back. mom like that? That's just terrible. Okay, now we gotta go into... Whoops. Now we gotta go into Fashion Police. Jesus Christ, 73 new options. Alright. Say so we gotta fashion it up. Oh yeah. Fashion tie. Um Screw it. Let's go with that for now. very important fashion time. Yeah. I'm feeling it. I am feeling it. Mm hmm. Interesting. Alright. I feel we're all fashioned up. Looking fly in our new kicks. Ah, the only thing that can defeat lava a broom. Hello, old lady. Oh, it's Selfie. Yes, I've heard of those. Yes, you have. <laughs> Thank you, old lady. Oh, wonderful. I'll see you on the internet. Now we need to get more followers. I sometimes forget the force tutorials. We already have six followers. Nice. Alright. Problem is these kids don't want to be your buddies yet. They don't want to be your friends. Come on, stupid. Hey, you got it open! You're the real deal, little superhero! Thank you. A, a selfie? Sure, kid, let's do it. Thank you. Okay, nice. And now we can go back to these well, people. Well, I guess we have enough mutuals that we can selfie. Hooray. Okay, you better follow me back. Okay, I guess you're popular enough to selfie with. Gotta collect those followers. Not bad, Budho. You're gaining followers pretty fast. Keep up the good work. I'm still having trouble reaching some of the Kuhn friends. You might want to see what's going on. Yeah, but first I need to get more followers. Alright, now let's 
let's uh, get back to what we were doing. Shit. Not what I meant. Mm, okay, we can get a selfie together. <gasps> Kenny, it is far too early in the story to go to, ca to, go to Casa Bonita cool. for you. We follow each other now. Who would do such a thing? It's just so mean. Hey, kid, you know anything about this? Somebody's keying my wife's car at night. It's happening every night. I thought it was just one of you damn kids, but we'll... Here, come here. Do I look, look tall enough to reach that? Come I'm on, Scratching Randy. the car is also leaving notes. I'm just scared it's a jilted lover or something. You won't forget me that easy. I thought we had something. I'll tell the world about you, bitch. Listen, I'm sick of having to buff this shit out. If you can catch whoever's keying my wife's car tonight, I'll follow you on Coonstagram. Trust me, you want me as a follower. I'm a pretty big deal in this town. Pretty big deal. Ah, I see you've made it to the Palace of the Clouds. That's home base to human kite. Perhaps you can find him inside. Whatever, Cartman. Ooh, Kyle's Negroplasty photo. Wonderful. Oh yeah, let's go let's go help out our buddy Kyle. After nicking all his shit. If you really just wanted to make a racist statement with the black person joke, uh, with the black person difficulty joke, you could make it so that the money people give you is less, but you get more money for stealing. But no. Who the hell are you? I'm nobody. Really? You yes. sent a newbie to my distress call? Yes. You're such a dick, Coon. You're a dick. Sorry, kid, but my problem is too big for a rookie. A few days ago, there was an anomaly in the universe. Another version of me, the human kite from an alternate dimension, showed up here and is destroying everything. Right now, it's upstairs in my room. I don't think anything can stop it. Has anyone told you that your name is very similar to a very racial slur against Jewish people? Just wanted to let you know. Human kite from another universe is behind this door. I can't fight him for obvious reasons, you know. Alternative universe paradox shit. So you are going to have to take him out. You've got to really kick his ass, dude, so that he wants to return back to his universe on the East Coast. You ready? Holy right, shit, I just it. realized my fucking outfit is completely the same texture as okay, that carpet. Kyle, I'm big! Who's your friend? Did he come to play with us? You can All right, that. me from another universe, it is time for you to go back to your universe! What do you mean, Kyle? We're a team, remember? I'm not from another universe, we're like best super pals. <laughs> super best friends. As you can see, he is the one running around giving the human kite a bad name. He was sent here to destroy me and weaken my power. No, no, I came to spend two weeks with my cousin and wanted to play superheroes. And then he said, okay, what superhero do you want to be? And I said, I want to be human kite. But he said, you can't be human kite, I'm human kite. And I said, well, why can't we be human kites together? So I went to Aunt Sheila and I said, I want to be human kites together. And she told him he had to do what I said because I was the guest. Remember? I'm sorry, me from another universe, but it is time for you to learn that playing superheroes is too painful. New kid, you must now destroy my alter ego. Oh, Jesus, we're gonna do. fight? That's yeah. right. If you really want to play, then this is how you do it. Well, all right. Anything to make me and my cousin more alike. Prepare for battle, weakling. <laughs> oh, I'm prepared. I'm very prepared. I haven't done a whole lot of sparring. Is this a no contact thing? Full contact, not sparring. Oh, I'm afraid that's impossible. I didn't bring my pads. It's happening. Get him, new kid. Cousin Kyle, we can beat him if we join forces. Yeah, I really want to, but parallel universe rules say I can't. Yeah, let's just put Gross out on him to start the fight with. <laughs> I'm getting a little I mean, tingle in my really throat. Matter. Does anyone have a lozenge? Oh my, there's a lot of decisions in this game, aren't there? You cannot play. That's a decision you could make. I like well, the decision. Oh, you guys, time out. My vertigo is starting to act up. Jesus, come on, dude. I'm actually curious now, because if you attack him, he says you didn't wait. What happens if I just then turn? Okay, I think my inner ear fluids have stabilized now. Uh, that last hit didn't count, right? I'm undoing that damage, okay, Kyle? What the fuck are you talking about? That's some classic alternate universe bullshit. I didn't even hit you. What the fuck? 
fuck do you mean that lasted? Okay. That wasn't too hard, right? I don't want to cause any permanent damage. Cousin Kyle, I called the timeout and he didn't listen. You know my asthma flares up when I exert myself. The fuck do you mean I didn't yeah, I listen? Think this would be a lot more fair if I had a shield. I Some literally kind of skipped two like turns for your bitch ass. Up, which also has a great sentimental value. Dude, human kite is an alien. There's no Jewish stuff involved. And you can't just make up powers in the middle of a battle. I'm not making it up. It's totally canon in my alternate universe. Ah. <sighs> This guy's like fucking Cartman, I swear. Wait, I thought I should get this turn instead of the new kid because he didn't wait when I said time out earlier, so I think it should be my turn now. Are you kidding me? That's totally cheating! Especially when I did give up two turns for you, jackass. Oh jeez, I didn't think I'd actually hit you. <sighs> oh jeez, did you have to hit so hard? Yes, I did. All right, here we go, my super ultimate power. Get ready. Are you ready? Oh, Jesus. Okay, Wrath Kite from an alternate universe. Man, I had no idea Kyle 2 was such a bitch. What a bitch. Yeah, I always just kept attacking him mindlessly. But even if you do listen to what he says, he says that you didn't. And tries to get oh, free shit oh, on Jesus. you. I think I might have ruptured my hair. God, you had enough alternate me? Yeah, this superhero stuff really hurts. I better go back to my university. Oh, you're leaving? Dude, that sucks. Yeah, I'll be going back to my universe now, human kite. I need some camphorphenique for my ear because I got a scrape on it and being farted on. Dude, I don't know how to thank you. From now on, call on me whenever you need help. Woo. We have the human kite. I mean kite. Alright, well, I think that's enough uh, for one episode. So... I don't really know how to end things.